Welcome back to the Football Referee with Emmy Hickens, Trevor Gear, and Femi Madariola. Significantly, as it would another team. But yeah, I, 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 I don't. I mean, they've got the business of the investigation going on against their 100 plus apparent or alleged um, failures or things done wrong. As we say, they're alleged. But I don't think the results of that will come out until the end of the season. So if they are deducted points, it certainly won't affect this season's performance. So I, I think it will either be, I mean, Liverpool, of course, are good. They've got a new manager, which may have an impact, not necessarily for the better. But I think it's going to be between Man City and Arsenal. That's my prediction, which you might say is a very easy thing to predict. But it doesn't always work that way. I think Arteta and Arsenal... He has this iron-like determination, and, I, and I, I respect that in him. I mean, I think sometimes it can make a manager a bit like Ferguson. It can make them see things through their own tinted spectacles, if you like. They don't often see the the other side of the coin. But in a way, you almost need that as a manager. I don't think you lose the dressing room when, it, when you're like that. You have a little bit of toughness, a little bit of fear even, and the players generally respond. And I think that's a good attribute a manager can have. So, yeah, I, I, to answer your question, I think Man City will be there, as they say, there or thereabouts at the end of the season. But then it could go either way. I think both Arsenal and City will win most of their games and it will come down probably to the last half dozen games. Whether Liverpool impacts on that, I don't know. I think they'll be in the top four. But I don't. Th I think the jury is out yet on... Is it Kloss, the manager, whatever his name is? Um, the jury's out because, you know, they had a slip up, didn't they, at home against Nottingham Forest, I think, which is very unusual. Um, so I'm not convinced that they are quite the same team and, as they were under Klopp. I think Klopp was uh, so established there and they played for him as well as for the team. So I don't know. I don't really see Liverpool challenging for the, the title which probably means, as I've said that, they probably will win it. <laughs> <Because> <laughs> I've not been known to be always overly accurate with my predictions. I, but I, 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 on balance, I think it will be either Man City or Arsenal. It won't be Crystal Palace, I'm sad to say. We're struggling, really. Um, as I say, we're playing Liverpool Saturday, which is not, not, not a given that Palace will lose. You never know with these things. Know, I think yeah. last year we actually went up to Liverpool and beat them. So that can happen, but we've won. We've played six games, I think drawn three and lost the others. So again, whether Oliver Glasner, if we keep losing, we've got Liverpool and then the international break and then it's uh, away to Forest and then home to Spurs. So it's a tough next three games and I don't want to see Glasner go. He's got a... He's got a... We're going to take a short break now. The football ref will be back shortly. You're listening to the Football Referee with Emmy Hickens, Trevor Gear, and Femi Madariola. The Football Referee will be back shortly. Please stay tuned. The Football Referee is looking for sponsors. If you're a business out there looking to spread the word about the products and services you offer, please get in touch on our website deepstuffrecords.com and also if you're looking to get involved on this show please reach out via our facebook page deep stuff radio or deep stuff records thank you